Hello and welcome back to uh, Teach You How Videos. Now, in my very first video I told you how to temporarily get rid of a an Internet Explorer number 7 toolbar. Well, in this one, I'm going to show you how to permanently get rid of it. Alright, it's just going to be gone for good. Alright, so, um, first make sure that your Internet Explorer is closed and no one else is using it. Now, second, you're going to go down to Start, click it, find Control Panel, click that as well. Okay. <coughs> Alright, so we're at uh, Control Panel. Just click on Add or Remove Programs. Now, actually, that might take a minute because I'm running this. Okay, uh, we're back. Now, um, that this is basically it. All you're going to have to do if you want to remove it is click on it. Let's say you don't want, let's say you don't want, um, this, uh, I don't know, let's see. Let's say you don't want the Yahoo toolbar. You click on it, go down, and you're going to click on remove. Okay, I'm not going to click on it though, because I, I think that some of these might actually come in handy. Alright, but that's, you're just going to click on remove if you want to get rid of it. Alright, and it's as simple as that, really. Alright, so, um, that's it. Alright, that, but remember, let me warn you, once you delete it it's it's deleted for good uh it doesn't it doesn't even go in here it's just deleted for good all right if you really want it again you're gonna have to download and install it again which sometimes could be could be a pain all right so that was it um i hope it helped thanks for watching bye bye